Hello guys. Um, oh, let me sit down. So, obviously I haven't been uploading at all recently. <laughs> um, so I just thought I'd do a little vlog um, just because they're quite easy to film and I've been really busy and I also wanted to do some updates. Um, so, <laughs> beginning of the month, um, I did actually vlog. I did a new added's first ever Farrier's appointment at the age of two, which is a little bit shocking, but <laughs> you know. Um, so, yeah, so he had his first Farrier's appointment, was petrified of the tools and spooked. I was in the way and got headbutted <laughs> square like here. I've still got a bit of a lump. Um, so that was the beginning of May. Um, it's now June. <laughs> So yeah, so I got headbutted and ended up with concussion and two black eyes and it was all very attractive. And yes, so that happened. Newt went on to an unplanned holiday for a month. Um, I took two weeks to recover and I'm still catching up on my orders for my shop. Um, if you guys don't know, I have a Etsy shop making like dog collars and stuff. Um, to put it in perspective, I got three orders whilst I was waiting to be seen in A&E. So the, it's been absolutely mental trying to keep up with that. So Newt went on to a month unplanned holiday, um, which has done him the world of good. He's been on the spring grass, he's fattened up, he's in a much better frame of mind. So it's done him the world of good. Um, so yes, that happened. Um, and that's part of the reason why I've why I've not been active. I've also got a full time job now, um, alongside the Etsy shop and the dogs, and I will be going into um, college to do dog training. Um, so whilst I've been recovering, I've been sort of focusing more on Loki than I have been Newt, so he could get some time off. Um, so if you were wondering where I were. Um, you'll probably be able to, I'll be a bit more active on Loki's channel um, and his Instagram page, which I'll link down below. Um, so if you want to check out that, if you want, it's like um, like dog tricks and vlogs and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, I'm just hiding in my tack room at the minute because I've been talking for ages. Um, I'm just gonna go get him down and lunch him. He had his first day off of holiday <laughs> on, Sunday, yeah Sunday, he had a few days off after that because he worked absolutely brilliantly, um, so I'm just going to go up and get him now and I'll do some lunging with him. <laughs> walking to Neat now. Um, he's in the summer field so I think the last time I vlogged he was in this field. Um, so you've got to kind of walk through the winter field to get to the summer field. <laughs> which is okay sometimes until it rains. Um, oh I think Newt's down the bottom which is really good. Um, so yeah. <sighs> he's been out on the spring grass which has been really good for him. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I've been worried that he'd got colic or something just because he suddenly got really fat. Um, <laughs> you can hear all the lambs. Um, yeah, just because he got really fat all of a sudden and I was really worried he got colic or something, but he's okay. I think he's... Okay, he's not that far from the fence, which is great. Um, so him being on his holiday has made him really, really positive, which is really good. I don't know why I didn't put him on holiday before. Um, so yeah, I think he's just going to be a 
a horse that whilst he's getting into it he's gonna need like a lot of frequent holidays don't you oh he's gonna no he hasn't walked up okay <laughs> yeah so he's gonna need a lot of frequent holidays um which is understandable because he is still a baby but i feel like that's probably what he's gonna need because he when i put him uh, before his holiday he got really really like filled sour he just did not want to come in at all and then on sunday after a month off he just came in no problems i didn't have to like coax him or anything so i think he really enjoyed just having the time off just to be a horse so yeah i'm gonna have to start keeping an eye on that um hopefully if he's that's his sign of saying i actually need a break so yeah i'll just keep an eye on him but he looks like he's coming down which is good usually he's right at the top of the field so, It's usually at the top, but he is. <coughs> Sorry about my voice, guys. I've got cold. <laughs> He's just there. Just there. Uh, looks like he might come down, possibly. But we'll see. I think Rosie's up there. Or well, Rosie might be there. Hi, yeah. Hi. Hi. Oh, he's actually coming down. <laughs> Hiya, buddy. No, he's not coming down, he's just giving up. Oh, he's doing a poo. Okay, that's fine. I'll let you off, Nick. Nick! Gorgeous little girly is Mama Rosie. That's not her full name, her, her full name's just Rosie. She, <laughs> you've taken Newt Toots under your wing, haven't you? She used to be a broodmare, and she loves the fact that Newt's a baby. <laughs> They're usually seen together, but he's all the way up there, so we're just going to get him. Whoa, birds. Nick! I don't know if you can see from there, but hiya! Are you doing another poo? Oh, just a little far, okay. So, I don't know if you can see, but he looks so much better now. He looks a bit more chunky and a little bit pregnant. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, he does look pregnant. He's not, obviously, he's a boy. Please don't trot at me, that's terrifying. Come on, should we go in? Come on. Hey, Baba. This is really nice, he's not actually uh, done this in ages. This, by the way, he scratched himself, I don't know if you can see, there, on barbed wire fence, because he's an idiot. Come on in, should we go? This is really nice, he's not done this and followed since before I put him on holiday. But look. He's looking good. He's looking super good. Okay, so he is behind me here. Where is he? There he is. Um, and yes, yeah, so he is leading a lot better now. Um, as you can see, it's usually, to be fair, it's usually when he gets out, like in that field, when he gets out of that field, he's usually fine. Um, it's just, he's doing really good stretching. <laughs> he loves his stretching. Um, yeah, so it's usually when he gets out of this field that he's fine, but in that field he's he's not he wants to just be with his mates. But at the minute he's doing really really well. And look how grown up he looks. You look really grown up, guy. Come in. No, you don't need to eat. No. Newton. No. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Good boy. Good. I'm falling off the track. Come on, Newt. Grass is always green on the other side, isn't it, Nick? Come on, let's go. Good, super. Newt. He's making noise. Uh, I just got Newton. It's a good boy. Um, 
So I think I'm at luncheon today, but I also might, might uh, trim him because he looks disgusting. So <laughs> I might make him look a lot better than he does. Uh, and then lunge him afterwards, I think. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go do that. Uh, I feel like, does he need hay? He has been eating grass all day though, I don't... Uh... Mm, sure, yeah, let's give him some hay. Okay, so, he probably won't eat because there's too much stuff going on anyway, so. Okay, I'm gonna go do that. And then, how are we going along with him? You can't itch on it. It's just hay, you can't itch on the hay. No. There you go, you eat the hay. Okay, what are you doing now? You're throwing it around, are you? That's on the floor. <laughs> Whoa! Stop dropping it! Apparently he needed to stop work because he needs to say hi to the pony. Okay, so, he's just here, just popping him back out into the field, he just walked into a flower, uh, just popping him back out into the field. He was very distracted today, he didn't really get much good stretching, but he was calm, relatively, there was a horse just making a load of noise next, um, in the field next to the lunging paddock, so <laughs> he was as calm as he could be, but he's walking really nice now, he's pretty chilled. I don't know if you can see him. I don't know. Um, yeah, and I gave him a little bit of a trim. Uh, tried to get a video of that, but he fidgeted really badly, so. <laughs> yeah, so he got trimmed. I did his mane, his forelock, his tail, uh, mainly. Um, 
so yeah I feel like I need I don't know whether to let his mane grow back out again or not I, I probably won't but he doesn't really like it getting pulled which is why I was using scissors if you could have seen it um, so oh now he stretches <laughs> so yes but I don't know if this vlog's going to be massively interesting or not but I just thought I'd do one because I haven't done it I haven't done a video in ages I have got some planned when I have time um, not too sure when that will be but what I might do is I might um, pre-film a bunch of videos and uh, yeah just pre-film them come on we don't need to eat and then just upload them fairly regularly maybe do that um, but yes but he's getting really itchy because of the flies so I feel like I probably need to get him some fly fly spray. Um, but I'm going to Hickster at the end of the month. I've got a little bit too much money to spend. <laughs> so <laughs> I'll probably end up with loads of matchy sets. I honestly don't care though. So I <laughs> uh, need to get a fly spray. Um, and yes, yeah, so I'll be filming that and I'll be feeling a haul, feel, bleh, filming a haul after that as well. Um, as well as a possibly come ride with me after that because I'm going out with my friend for a hack, not obviously on him. Uh, she got some vouchers for her birthday to go for a hack. Come on you, stop grazing uh, to go for a hack. Come on. So we're going to be going for a hack. If I can borrow someone's GoPro then I will do a go film with me. Come uh, come ride with me. Oh my god you made me jump. Um, so yes, it all depends on time. <laughs> so yeah I'm just putting him back out now. Um, you can see how long it takes for me to get to his summer field because I've been talking for the whole journey there. <laughs> and according to my phone, it's 2 minutes 51. So, yes. Mama Rosie's waiting at the gate, so I'm going to let him off. Uh, not now, obviously. I'm going to go put him back. He's very keen. He's just spotted his Mama Rosie. So, yes. And then I will probably talk to you again when I get home or something. Ooh. You did, Mama Rosie. Usually he runs off, but apparently that's not happening. Hiya. Hello, Snips. Ah, uh, thanks for the licks. That's great. She's also a Welsh. So, I also measured him as well, which I didn't say. I didn't even think I filmed that, so it'd be quite interesting to see how tall he's got since he's been away, because he definitely looks taller. Um, he was, last time I measured him, I think he was about 14'2", if I remember rightly. He was 14'2". Um, I was told <laughs> when I got him that he would mature to 15'2". I think he's going to pass that, because <laughs> if he's like 14'2", now, at the age of two, he must be, he's going to be like 16 hands, surely. Which is great, it's fine. Um, but I just don't really like big horses. <laughs> and I wanted something around 15 to 15 too, because that would be like my perfect height. Because I'm only like 5'4", so... Um, yeah, I struggle to ride bigger horses, especially if they're any bigger than like 15 to 15 3 at a push. 16 and onwards. Uh, I do find really difficult to ride, so <laughs> we'll see. I'm just hoping maybe if he doesn't chunk out too bad, I might not look too small on him. So let's hope for that. So yeah, um, yeah, I will be doing like I said, I can't, I'll do be we'll be doing a couple more videos, um, but I'll probably end the vlog here. Um, so yes, I'm sorry for not being that active. Um, but yeah, <laughs> I've been slightly concussed, so it's been hard to be active. <laughs> um, so yes, oh, it's getting really hot now, I think. So I will see you guys in my next video, which hopefully will be a lot better than this one. <laughs> see you later. <laughs>